Welcome to Alm English Tutor. Today I'm going to talk about an important topic that is setting of a story or a novel. Setting is one of the important elements of a story, but it is generally ignored when compared with theme and characterization. So today we are going to learn what is actually included in a setting. So let's talk about those elements one by one. First of all is time, that is when. So in which time period the story is set? like past, present, future, or any particular century, or any age, like Victorian age, modern age, time of the day, day, night, morning, evening, a particular year, like 2017, a month, April, any day, 3 p.m., 6 p.m., the time. So it all depends on the choice of the writer. Place, where? The geographical location. City, country, town, street, Story can be set in a hospital, a room, a restaurant, a spaceship, a cave, an underground tunnel, or it can be even an imaginary place like fairyland or a different planet. Setting also involves environment, the physical landscape like rivers, forest, mountain, deserts, or the climate, and even the weather because weather also plays its role like if it's summer, winter, and so on. Now, socio-cultural context, the historical context, in which time period is it is being set, like it's time of COVID, let's say, or political background of the story, cultural norms and values that are there, or economic condition of that land, that area, that is also included in setting. Lastly, some examples from literature, like Lord of the Rings is set in Middle Earth, then we have Charles Dickens, Oliver Twist is set in 19th century London, Thomas Hardy, who is considered a regional novelist, portrays fictional world, it is imaginary world called as Wessex. Then we have a magical world created by J.K. Rowling in Harry Potter. And another uh, example is Brave New World that shows a dystopian science fiction novel that is set in 2025. I hope you've understood uh, the concept of setting. If you like the video, don't forget to subscribe the channel. Thanks for watching.